it just destroys everything and I have to rebuild my shack and, oh, it's a nightmare. But I digress, you know, I don't. Did you know that I, I used to work? Actually, I used to work for the G3. <laughs> Could you believe that? Yeah, and I, I deserted it, obviously, and uh, there's, a, there's a death warrant out for my arrest, and I'm fine with it. I'm fine with it because I'm happier with the choices I've made today. I've started to take care of the little Fergals around my, my site. Fed them and clothe them. Healed them when they make mistakes. And you know, my mother, oh, oh, she, she always said, oh, you'll join G3 one day. You're not good, Quentin. She always would say that about me. You're not good. As if my three hearts couldn't have goodness in them. I don't even want to get started on her. You have no idea what it's like to have a mother who doesn't support your dreams. All I ever wanted to be was a jungle seamstress. I wanted to grab the purple trees and create amazing clothing for the commoners here at Zephyr. But no, no one believes in me. No one gave me the Clorglocks to save up. So I joined the G3 out of desperation. That have way to feel something, anything. I, I've been aimless most of my life. Uh, I'm alone here, to be honest, and just in a valley covered with sludge. Fergals, but at least the Fergals don't judge me. Not like my mother! Oh, God, not even when I get into it! She drove my father away when I was only six clicks old! Do you know how embarrassing it is to lose your father at six clicks? I got teased relentlessly in high school. But no, I still go to my mother's lily pad and I still heal her, take care of her when she's sad. Because I'm a good boy, regardless of what she thinks! Regardless of what choices I've made in the past. I didn't want to get started on my choices I've made, on my relationships I've had. Oh, Tiffany, oh, I had a real one. She was so pure. She could sing like an angel, oh. And then I fucked it up. I lied to her about what I did. She said, Quentin! Leave and never come back! Now she's dating some Kling Clark creature who's got a good job and a good family and he's in therapy and he's doing everything he needs to do to be the perfect guy for her. So now I'll never get Tiffany back. I'll just sit here alone in my valley and just think about her and just wish, pray for the one time our entrails can thrust together again. And you know, I just... Ah, I don't even know where to begin, what to end. I've been all over, just trying to find someone real. I dated a moblet once. Huh. They're fucking nuts. They want to get started into their lives. Let's just say it didn't work. You know, I'm tired of just giving and giving. That's why I quit the G3. I, I just couldn't goop another person. Do you know how much it takes out of you to goop someone? It hurts. And personally, I only want to goop someone I'm in love with. Make sure they're not using me, because I've dealt with that before. Had a, a lover who was basically a goop sexual. All he wanted me to do was just goop him up on, the, on a warm night and he used me. And I, I just don't want to be used anymore. Ah, but, you know, I digress. I, it's nice just to hang out sometimes. You know, see what you're doing. You're a bounty hunter, obviously. Yeah, I can see that. Uh-huh. Got weapons. Very scary weapons. And, and I love that they talk, like, I'm alone, oh! If, if I had a knife that talked, I would be a happy man, huh? So you're, your life seems interesting, to say the least. I'm just gonna watch you do your thing. I'm gonna watch you move around, yeah. Just sway back and forth, yeah, check that gun. Okay, yeah, they got something to say too. Oh, that's good. Yeah, I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna stare at you now. I'm gonna stare real close. Oh, no, no, don't, don't worry, I'm just, I'm just watching you. Just, just taking you in. Taking in all of you. I'm just taking in all of you. Huh. Look, what a sight. Look at you move, look at you sway. Yeah, you're, a, you're a bounty hunter, all right. Ho, ho, ha, 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 yeah, you are. Just look at you, look at you. Like, just look at your, look at yourself. Do you have a, you, can you see through me? Can you see you through me? Wow. If, if you saw what I saw, 
you'd say, damn, <laughs> that's me. <laughs> I like your, I like your outfit. That's, it's quality material. I like the way, you know, sometimes when like two people can just sit in silence and just be, when two beings can just sit in silence and just be, it just shows a closeness of like spirit. When you don't have to fill the time, you don't have to fill the void with talk, with words. Just take each other in like I'm taking you in right now. I'm just taking you in. And boy, it, it's, it's good. Oh, ha <laughs> it's good. You feel that wind? Yeah, it's just like circling around me, wow. All right, well, I'm, I'm just gonna go quiet and, I'm just gonna watch you now. I'm just gonna go quiet and watch you. I'm being quiet now. I'm just gonna watch you now. Stop! 